Sonia Eddy was an American actress. Eddie was born in Concord, California on June 17, 1967. She majored in theater and dance at University of California, Davis and received her BA in 1992. Sonia Eddy estimated net worth in $1 million to $5 million. Eddy made her acting debut in the Ruby Dee's play Zora Is My Name in 1990. Other stage credits included The Comedy of Errors, The Witch in Stephen Sondheim's Into the Woods and Bloody Mary in South Pacific. From 2004 to 2005, she had a recurring role on Joan of Arcadia. In 2006, Eddie began playing Epiphany Johnson on General Hospital on a recurring basis. From 2016 to 2019, she played Tammy in the true TV comedy series, Those Who Can't. Eddie died on December 19, 2022, at the age of 55. Franco Harris was an American professional football player who played running back in the National Football League for 13 seasons, primarily for the Pittsburgh Steelers. He was a key player in one of professional football's most famous plays, dubbed the Immaculate Reception by Pittsburgh sportscaster Myron Cope. Harris claimed that he extended his career and thus his contribution to the team's objectives, including four Super Bowl victories, by avoiding unnecessary contact. Harris served as part of the advisory board at Penn State Center for Food Innovation and in the fall of 2009 was named a county professor by Penn State's School of Hospitality Management. Harris died on December 20, 2022, three days before the 50th anniversary of the Immaculate Reception at the age of 72. Stanley Drucker was an American clarinetist. Drucker was highly regarded for his musicianship and his longevity of service with the New York Philharmonic, totaling 10,200 concerts, such as expressed by Gustavo Dudamel in November 2007. He's a legend. The history of the orchestra is in him. On Thursday, June 4, 2009, Drucker was awarded a Guinness World Record for longest career as a clarinetist after his performance of Aaron Copland's clarinet concerto with the orchestra. Guinness thus logged his philharmonic career at 62 years, 7 months and 1 day as of June 4, 2009. In 2010, Stanley Drucker received an honorary doctorate in music from the University of Florida. Drucker died in Vista, California on December 19, 2022, at the age of 93. Please like the video and subscribe to the channel. I need your support.